Hi guys, this is Paula with Beadsaholic, and today we're going to take a close look at Niwa Beads. This is one of my favorite um, bead brands, and they're an exclusive here on Beadsaholic. So you'll see all the updates here. Um, it is an amazing, unique brand that is every bead is an exclusive, so it's limited edition these are numbered beads and they are only available through Nawa beads and their associates there in uh, Thailand and Taiwan and uh, at story in the bead and at beads fanatic now each store carries different beads or some beads that are exclusive to certain stores and um, usually I have that information here but you can always contact Niwa Beads directly and they can direct you to where you need to go. And usually they can, you know, you can get the beads directly through them as well. I'm going to show you the latest releases first and then I'm just going to go over a few of the ones that are still available to this date. A few of them may have sold out, but you know, you, that's easy to find out. So the first one is going to be this little guy right here and this is called love me teddy now this particular one is not available yet but he is just releasing and he will be available soon on the niwa beads website and you can contact them through facebook or instagram Let's see if we can get a good zoom on him oops this is a mama bear holding chain to her baby bear. As sometimes we are very protective. You can see a little patch here on the arm because our kids wear us down. We have a dangling lock, I'm sorry, key, and a dangling lock that moves. Nice little detailing. She's got patches on the back. On her rear end, cute little details to the feet. I love how Niwa beads are so detailed. The hair, I mean, you can literally feel it, the details of it. Little hair poking up where it's ruffled and, and then you got the patches and just so much detail. Let's look at this little baby. And I think as parents, you know, we can relate at times. I'm not saying that our kids chain us down, but um, I think of it more of an in a protective way. And I think this is really cute. I know if I, I'm sure at times my son feels like he's chained to me. Because I'm a, a very protective mother, I don't let him, you know, stray away far. He's 10 years old, so, you know, I, I'm still protective about him going outside. And and um, there's just so much in the world these days. And you kind of have to have your children in near and need to know where they're at and who they're with. You know, I've raised one son already, which is 28. And, and um, it's just the times have changed so much over the years that chaining your kids yourself to your kids is not always a bad thing <laughs> you know speaking metaphorically of course but I just thought this is such a beautiful bead and the details are just amazing so go on to the next new release which is Nawa, uh, Niwa Wings of Dream Spacers when you order these you get two spacers instead of one they do come as a pair I believe yes and um, these come in either ruby or sapphire and I have the ruby which are my favorite of the two 
um, 75 euros for a pair and uh, you can order these directly through Nala Beads it is a Singapore exclusive how amazing are these the detailing the butterflies I mean the flowers and there's different flowers and if you look at the background it looks as though this is a branch wrapping around the rod. We have different types of butterflies. This is one of the main things I love about Niwa beads is they pay so much attention to the details and they use every bit of the usable space on a bead. They fill them in nicely and you can see here you know it just each little piece is so unique the leaves are detailed the flowers are detailed the butterflies are detailed in each one a little different and I just really love that about these beads again you can c contact Niwa beads on Facebook or Instagram to find out more about these beads and how to order it is an exclusive you can order directly through them and they can give you the sellers there in Singapore and I believe Taiwan but these are just beautiful the stones as you can see is a nice quality it's beautifully done also um, releasing and these are available through Nawa and Niwa and through Beads Fanatic the first one is Golden Blink Ruby and I really like these the, these two beads with some of the ruby stones that they use in their silvers I think it's a nice touch I have a lot of golden glitter and they're beautiful beads nice they keep the size you know they're very similar and that again is the golden blink ruby it is currently on the beatsfanatic.com website for sale. And they have live photos so you can choose your beads. This bead here is also available through Nawa Beads, Aniwa Beads, and Arua Op. I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> Niwa Beads and beatsfanatic.com. And these are called the Aurora Opal Diamond. And again, limited. The um, Golden Blink Ruby is limited to 98. And the Aurora Opal Diamond is limited to 53. Again, there are live images on beadsfanatic.com. This is a very beautiful bead. And if you have any of the Troll Beads Aurora, you will find that they match nicely this is a standard size bead really pretty again they're pretty consistent in sizes and control over glass I mean, there will be some variations, of course, as they are with any glass beads. But as you can see, you know, mine are matched pretty well. Okay, now that we've, we've um, looked at the newer releases, I want to go over some of the styles that are still available. Um, first, I'm going to show you the three exclusive beads pull them up here 
and I'm not sure if the dragon is still available but I know the phoenix and the koi are and these are mama mala you can contact nala beads directly I have the sapphire and they come in sapphire jade and ruby and I have it each but you can pick your beads so if you wanted all sapphire and all three you could do that again I don't know that the dragon is still available I'm just gonna put these together so you can see that they're all the same size they have 18 karat gold and sterling silver I'll show you the dragon first. It's the oldest of them. And because of the limited edition, again, I don't know, you know, if these are still available. Let's turn it this way. You can see the, the dragon. His mouth is open. You can see the detailing. As I turn it around, the dragon is wrapped around. We have roses beautiful dragon tail the claw more roses you can see his claws are wrapping around one of them is wrapping around the sapphire it's just beautifully done The detailing, again, I mean, you can see they use every bit of space when they are making these beads. It's beautiful. Next up is the Koi. And as you can see, mine has the Jade, the 18 karat gold around it. And, um... If you look, it has the lotus pods, and then look how beautiful. I really want to get a little closer on this. It's as close as I can get, but you can see how beautiful the lotus flower is here at the top. And then you see the koi fish, see the beautiful fins. But I want you, the lily pad, the lily pad, but I want you to pay attention right here. There is a lotus pod here. The little fish is blowing bubbles. How cute is that? I just love that the little bubbles coming out of his mouth. And then if you keep going around, we have another and there's some more bubbles, some more lotus, another fish with bubbles coming up next to the jade with another lotus pot up top. But, I mean, how beautiful is this? I mean, every little space is just so detailed. It is just amazingly done. And this is the Mama Mala up under the Niwa name brand. the next one is going to be the phoenix again this is mama La mala it's one of three beads that you can get it's ruby here with 18 karat gold going around let's see here let's turn it here you see his head his feathers at the top little flowering detail here a wing going out this way and that way and then as we go down we see more feathering drop down see that he is holding his his talons are holding the ruby itself and this is where his tail starts to wrap and then look at the beautiful tail feathers some coming out right here flower over to the side and then as I go around you see a wing coming down here 
and tail flat feathers wrapping up there towards his head. So this bird is wrapping completely around the bead and has the flower detailing and the ruby. Again, you can get it in ruby, sapphire, jade. These are limited. I don't know the exact number of these or how many are still available. So please contact Niwa Beads on either Facebook or Instagram. As you can see, it's beautifully done. Just a stunning bead. Now, on to a few others. These is a, this is a pair of spacers and it's called Lucky Me Spacer Pair. And as you can see, it's got four leaf, four leaf clovers all the way around. These are available at Beads Fanatic, Story in the Bead, and of course with Niwa Beads. Beautifully done. I have reviewed these a while back on the blog. So, of course, you can see more photos where I've used them there. And I've used them in today's review as well. So, if you'd like to see these on the bracelets that I created today, you can check those out on Beadsaholic.com. Again, this one is Lucky Me Spacer Pair. Wish You Luck came out a while back, and I'm sure that the numbers on these are getting low. Um, this one is available at BeadsFanatic.com and through Nawa Beads. It's shaped like a dice, and um, you can see the little diamond, and we have a lion here. So you can... These animals represent different types of luck and what they bring to you. Here we have the horse. Here we have the, the koi with the spade. There was heart with this one. And then the dragon clubs. Beautifully done. The details on these are amazing. I like the depth that we see the design on the sides. Which makes these stick out really well. And they're beautifully done. Let's see it is a cube shape. Again, this one is available through Niwa Beads and through BeadsFanatic.com. Now this bead here. I believe is sold out and I, please bear with me I think it's pronounced Bowiga B-O-W-E-G-A and um, there is some history behind this and I wrote about it on the blog a few months back um, however Beads Fanatic has this one in stock with gemstones right here so if you like this design, I don't you can check with Niwa Beads to see if it's available without the stone, but I believe it's only available with the stone and that is through Beads Fanatic. This next one is Secret Garden and this is available through Beads Fanatic and com and story in the beads and Niwa beads has a beautiful sleeping happy calm serene face with flowers and we see the the whole how it sticks out and how each one is just carved in so beautifully and we have flowers and we have dragonflies, leaves, and just everything all the way around. It is beautifully done. We even have a little 
ladybug right there. There's the ladybird, as some say. And I just love the detailing on this bead. So it's kind of like a bee right here. The dragonflies are just so pretty. Nice little butterfly over here to the side. Beautifully done. And again, those are available at both um, Beats Fanatic and Story in the Bead. These next two are called Daisy Garden Drop. One is in Malachite and the other one is in Turquoise. And Beats Fanatic still has um, limited stock of these. Looks like I needed to polish them a little bit more because mine have a little bit of a, or a little bit dirty. But as you can see, it's got flowers around the bell. In the top, you've got dragonflies, um, flowers all the way around, and they're just beautifully done. Stones are really nice quality. It's really pretty. I really like these. And there is, if you search on beadsaholic.com and you look for Nawa beads, you will find um, a review on these from last year. But again, there is a few left over on, on Beads Fanatic. And I'm gonna show you next the Infinity However, this particular one in all silver is sold out. Beats Fanatic has the same design, but one of these is going to be gold. So if you missed out on the silver version, just know that you can get it in the two-tone version as well. This is actually one of my favorite charms. I would love to have it in the two-tone just to have a second one to this. I like pears and dangles sometimes, and I, I like using these, because usually I put dangles towards the back, but I like putting these, you know, towards the front or sides of a bracelet of a design. But um, these are beautifully done. Each little coin. So sorry about the shake. My son just came out of the house, headed next door to play with some kids, and and I don't think you realized that I was out here recording. Sorry about that. But um, I wanted to show you this. And these three little keys were an exclusive last year. Beats Fanatic had some stock in these. So if you wanted some of the keys I believe this one in the middle is now sold out but I wanted to show you these real quick just so you can see them up close they are really beautifully done I really like these designs this one here looks like there's vine wrapping around has the little Niwa tag off the back. So sorry for the dog barking, barking in the background. Everybody's interrupting a little bit today. <laughs> and next, I just wanted to take a quick glance at the baby glass. I believe the leopard print are still available. There's some stock still available at Beats Fanatic. I think you'll find some of these are now available. I think it's this pair here. And I believe the lime are available on Story in the Bead. My suggestion is just to go look and kind of take a look at what's available. 
like I said, these are limited edition, so sometimes they sell out faster than, than I can get them posted to you. But um, I wanted to show these to you, and uh, I do suggest going to the two websites and checking them out and seeing what's left. This pair here on the end, I know, is the Rolly Fresh. And it is an exclusive at Beats Fanatic. And um, stock is getting pretty low on these. So if you like those, I suggest going over there. These are, let me show you here. It is a baby glass. So they're going to be smaller than the standard glass. I think these run around... Um, 12 millimeters and they're about the size of the troll beads prism so that should give some of our collectors an understanding in the size I like the smaller glass uh, and you know it's one of the reasons why I like elf beads so much elf petite is because you, know, you can wear these glass beads and you know when you're especially if you type or something they don't stick out as far but that is our close look at Niwa Beads. You can see everything else on Beadsaholic.com. I will have a complete um, information on this guy and these stoppers here. And a few other products like the Phoenix. I'll have more photos over on Beadsaholic. So be sure to check those out. And I hope you guys have a good night. And uh, also, um, I don't know how many tickets are left, but if you were in the in Thailand or one of the surrounding countries and you'd like to meet, I will be at the Niwa event in Bangkok, Thailand on November the 24th, I believe it is. So I hope to see you guys there. I'm excited and um, I can't wait. So I'll talk to you soon. Have a good evening. Bye-bye.